No matter what martial arts you're training, there are three red flags to look out for when it comes to your coach. There are a lot of great martial art coaches out there, but we have to understand every martial art coach is just a human being. And unfortunately, just like there's great martial arts coaches, there are also some rotten apples. And here are three things that you need to look out for before you start training at a gym, or even if you are currently training, making sure that it's a right fit. Number one, has the coach been known to injure students more than once? That's definitely a red flag, and especially when it comes to coaches that tend to brag about having hurt someone, uh, that's a real big red flag and something that you should avoid. Are you there to please your coach's ego, or are you there to be taught how to do whatever martial arts you're doing properly? Number two, can you safely ask questions during class? What I mean by that is, can you ask questions without the coach getting irritated, feeling that you're potentially questioning their knowledge, um, and being met with somewhat of an attitude, or even other people in class laughing at you? A great coach wouldn't allow that to happen, so it's key to be able to find a safe place where not only are you safe in training, but also where you dare to ask questions so that you can improve. Red flag number three. Does the coach speak about other members behind their back? If they do, there's also a chance that they speak about you behind your back and something that you should avoid because that's toxic behavior, something that you want to avoid. Just knowing that when you go to your martial arts school, your academy, your gym, that's your safe place. That's your home away from home where you can train in a comfortable and fun and safe environment. What else do you want to know? Ask in the comments below.